Hi, I've been writing songs for my new album that we've been recording here at the village in LA, Studio D, legendary studio um, in this booth that was built uh, for Stevie Nicks. So there's a lot of energy and wonderful atmosphere. It feels very special to be recording here. Um, in the process up to recording here with producer Larry Klein. This whole record is about finding the, the song. I'm just gonna make it to regular form. Almost like he does a half tag and then a full tag. Right, right, you know? yeah. It's almost antithetical to having an arrangement per se. In fact, in fact, what, 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 I, what I don't want is that, I, that it would feel arranged. I'm really trying to get at a much more painterly approach. Yeah, let's just see what, see what, where it see takes what us. Happens. <laughs> yeah. Yes. I've been writing a tapestry of, of songs um, with my co-writers back home in England, um, Paul Edis, Greg Susan, Hannah V, uh, Ian Barter, and I've been sending my catalogue over to Larry um, over the last few months. Here's to all the ones who feel it deeply. But he's bringing their kind of vibe and their interpretation and their input. We have um, Anthony Wilson playing guitar, and Jim Cox is on uh, E3 organ, piano, keys, Wurlitzer. Um, we've got Victor Indrizo on the drums and percussion. And we had Dave Pilch on bass as well as Larry Klein playing bass. So um, a few legends there. <laughs> um, all here to create this um, wonderful record. I know you're right about the blues. You live some life you would never choose. I'm just a fool, a dreamer who. It's like a, a dream come true. We're making magic here. And she is just amazing. You guys are all amazing. <laughs> <laughs>